I've all went to Eton and then on at Oxford. I'm not saying he lived a charmed life, but the only thing that's been filled with more privilege is Meghan Markle's fanny. <laughs> I've been extremely lucky. <laughs> so, uh, Fern, uh, I watched all of your comedy videos to prepare for this roast, uh, which was a mistake, because uh, it's very difficult to roast someone whose work you respect, and I genuinely think you're a brilliant stand-up with a lovely take on the world. <laughs> Just joking, couldn't understand a bloody word she was saying. <laughs> Not having a go, Fern, you're a brilliant stand-up, but all of your shows should be called Self-Pity with subtitles. <laughs> I went to Eton where he claims never to have seen any homosexual activity. It's pretty unusual, but I guess it's hard to see when you're being blindfolded and hogtied, then buttfucked by the Sultan of Brunei's nephews. <laughs> I've been extremely lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Fern actually used to suffer from OCD, which must have been an absolute nightmare, given her whole life has been a total fucking mess. Now, <laughs> in a way, she had to become a stand-up, because the only other career option available to a Scottish person with OCD is organised crime, and then reorganised crime, and then reorganised time six more times, or your family dies. <laughs> so inbred that when he has a baby with his lovely fiance, Hindus will worship it as a god instead of the multi-limbed freak it actually is. Daniel, you creepy-looking androgynous motherfucker. <laughs> Daniel can't actually wear a kilt because people just think he's transitioning. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> you look like Ellen DeGeneres, but somehow older and more lesbian. <laughs> Good one, Rice Paddy McGuinness. <laughs> uh, last season I destroyed Desiree Birch, a beautiful African-American woman, and this season I'm up against Phil Wang, a Malaysian whatever gender neutral sign that is. <laughs> it's nice to know that Comedy Central see me as the Aryan Hammer. <laughs> and like most Scotsmen drunk at 3 a.m., watch me fucking destroy this greasy Chinese. <laughs> Good one, Yawn Connery. Uh, <laughs> Daniel, how are you so successful? Your comedy sucks, man! <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I would say you're as funny as waterboarding, but even waterboarding has at least one decent gag. <laughs> no, I mean, you were good at Home Alone, but since then, what have you done? Good one, Bruce Lee Jenner. 